So now I buy it and it happens to be from a small business. And I just happen to post it when I'm out with my friends. Yeah. Imagine waking up getting dragged on social media because you didn't tag her, them yeah. when I paid for the item yeah. tax and shipping. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. this doesn't really have me pressed because I feel like I'm, I kind of contribute to this. But basically, I've seen some stuff online lately with like, people <laughs> i've seen some stuff online with people and i've realized that influencers celebrities um have started to come out and say listen don't post me if i've paid you if oh. i've paid you for a service i don't need to do a b and c and Word. do you guys remember that they dragged Kylie Jenner for it. And you guys know I'm a Kylie Jenner Oh yeah, fan. I hated that. I'm a stan. It's like somebody has bought something, supported your brand. And it's like, you know, sometimes when celebrities wear things, do you not know that the internet is the FBI? Yeah, but The way they can find, find someone's boyfriend from one tattoo, yeah, yeah, yeah. you think they're not going to find a dress yeah. that's on Google and you yeah. can do Google image 100%. search. Mm. I just feel like when it comes to influences and celebrities, if like say for example me yeah i innocently go on like a page that i've seen on instagram because you know instagram likes to listen to what i'm talking about with my friends and suggest me things that apparently i need so now i buy it and it happens to be from a small business and i just happen to post it when i'm out with my friends yeah. imagine waking up getting dragged on social media but because you didn't tag them yeah. when i paid for the yeah. item yeah. tax and shipping yeah what gets me pressed about this whole situation is i feel that if we was to go to I don't know a mm. nail tech for example it's not the influence not the Instagram one the normal nail tech like nine out of ten mm. how much how many times I asked to take a picture of your nails mm. you've paid for a service you've paid for a service you're gonna go if they want the additional promo they will pay yeah. for that additional promo they'll pay for a model to do their hands to show their to show their work why are you putting pressure on me to to get the yeah. picture when I paid am. for a service so are you gonna pay for me for the the amount oh of people that God. will go on your page now oh and my God. buy and get the service exactly. Mariam I feel, don't, do you not feel Feel like sometimes they take the power away from us. Hundred like, percent. I feel like sometimes, well. like say for example, I was to buy from like a small business, yeah, and I didn't like their customer service because they told me it was gonna come in five days, but it came in three weeks. But I still like the dress and I posted in a dress. Why didn't you tag the dress? Why didn't you tag? You don't know what's yeah. happening behind the scenes. Like yeah. when it comes to my photographer, my makeup artist, my nail tech, and my hairstylist, yeah. I've never done anything for free for them. I always pay hey, them. 100%. But it's like, because I mess with them, it's like, I'm going to tag you. But sometimes you don't understand. Like, I felt like even if I if I bought from a small business, I had to promote. And it's like, I'm giving free promo that pe for people that see my name and give me better customer service than you're giving normal customers. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like sometimes when people see that something is for influencers, even restaurants do that. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Like restaurants will see, oh, this is for an influencer. And they'll, act up but it's like for your regular customers you're not giving that same energy and yeah. when the regular customers go there and don't see that same energy is yeah. Nella told me to come here and it was oh, Nella told DMs. me to buy yeah. here and it was mm. I really didn't it was the pressure yeah I don't give a if people have a problem with it like I had a, a time where I paid a stylist because I had to pick I had a collab and it's like mm. I had to pick stuff on my website and sometimes mm. it's long so I was like I'm paying you pick out my outfits for me and that's that and this girl wanted to post every single picture I was posting. And to me, I find that annoying because one, I don't even like your service and you're mm. posting me on your page. Yeah. And, and I paid you. Yeah, yeah, and you're making it look like mm. you're happy I like your work, yeah. but I don't mm. like your service. You know, sometimes you just pay for something, but you don't like the service, but yeah. you just want it. Yeah. And then I said, babe, don't post me. Like I paid. Mm. And she yeah. was just like, oh, um, okay. I feel like sometimes as influencers, you just have to actually be firm and stand yeah. your ground, which I've no. But then if you do, yeah. sometimes it's like, Oh, like, I don't know if you guys know, there's a clip of Nicki Minaj, yeah, she's in a oh, pink yeah. wig, and she says, when a man is assertive, he's a boss. Mm. Yeah. When a girl is assertive, she's a, a diva. Bitch, yeah. And I'm so sorry, I'd rather people call me a, a bitch and a diva yeah. than me go home feeling shit because it's like, oh, why did I let them do that? Oh, why yeah. did I let them do that? Like, yeah, like, you know, like sometimes, like let's say you've paid to go somewhere to do something mm. and now you're thinking, oh, do I need to go with makeup now because they want to take pictures of me? They yeah. But it's like, no, yeah. I've paid for a service. service yeah. I should be able to just walk in there. If I say no pictures, yeah. walk back out. The worst thing is when you don't even feel comfortable 
with the picture mm. or the content being posted. <gasps> yeah. And it's like, you don't understand what it does to me. I'm at the end of the day, you Mario, the, it's not even about the work, it's about <laughs> the drama that content or that, that post brings. Because it'll forget even about your whatever you've done for me, the service. It's about the fact that, oh, this influencer looks off in this picture or this influencer looks like this. They don't get that, yeah. what that does to you mentally. And that's yeah. They don't what, care, babe. They don't care. Because they think influencers are bulletproof.